We are at the historic Stallings Playground. For those of you that missed it, we jumped in this pool the other day. It was cold. It was a lot of fun. The kids had a blast. This is our seventh NOLA for Life Day. We have all of the city agencies in this neighborhood. I want to thank all of the volunteers for being out here. We actually have our young men and women from the National Guard Youth Challenge. You guys are awesome. Give them a big round of applause. We have sent our teams out here from the city. We've been filling potholes, fixing lights, cleaning catch basins. I know you guys are going to do a lot of work in the neighborhood. And this is part of our overall NOLA for Life murder reduction strategy, which, as you know, uh, is very tough, very difficult, uh, but is designed to make sure that we make the city of New Orleans safe. And so I want to thank all of you for coming out. We're going to work throughout the day. We also have a recruitment class, uh, recruitment effort right down the street. If anybody wants to be a New Orleans police officer, we're looking for the best. So you guys come on out and help us with that. And I want to just give a shout out to all of the city employees that have been working out here. I think we have uh, most of the departments out here. And then collectively with all of you, we have 175 to 200 volunteers. Because at the end of the day, you know, it's got to be everybody pulling in the same direction and everybody doing their part, and we can't do it uh, without your help. So I'm so thankful for you guys being out here. I also want you to help me welcome the first lady who came out with us today, yay, Cheryl. And our, our fire chief, Tim, Tim McConnell, and also the Booster Club from Stallings. Where are you? Raise your hand. Yay. Morgan, how you doing? Nice to see you. Hey, you guys. Thank you all so much. And I know we're going to do a little bit of peace in a little while uh, with the Booster Club, but... They raised $12,000, and they got Dick Sporting's Good to add another twelve for a total of $24,000 for the playground. So I thank you for that. And, of course, Dick is with us. He's been helping run a great Nord summer program. We want to make sure we get our kids where they need to be so they can have fun. And Nadia Coleman is here, who's helping us connect young people, young teenagers to jobs with Job One because we want to make sure our kids have something to do this summer. So God bless all of you. Thank you so much, and I hope you guys have a wonderful day.